At the foot of the Puetz Odle Natural Park in South Tyrol, the valley of Funes seems to be framed by the chain of the Odle. Man, nature and old traditions live in harmony in the midst of these mountains. Technological progress is instrumental in protecting the environment and promoting ecologically sustainable growth. The water that flows in the valley is always turned into energy by the Funes Electric Power Company. The company's mission is to produce renewable energy from local sources. The numerous solar panel installations and district heating stations are a clear example of this. A network spanning more than 12 kilometers carries and distributes heat to residential areas in a clean and ecologically sustainable way. But let's turn to the production of electricity through environmentally friendly stations that exploit water as a source of permanent, clean and inexhaustible energy. The water is harnessed in a piping system that connects the villages of Santa Maddalena and San Pietro. It is old piping, over 30 years old, which needs maintenance to increase the production of energy and stop any internal corrosion. The company found itself at a crossroads. Either continue with traditional systems, which would have meant laying new piping, or choose more innovative, environmentally friendly and more efficient ways. There was only one choice. No dig, no excavation. After a careful analysis of the techniques of restoration, the engineer Roberto Carminati from the EUT office in Brixen identified the Sandflex system proposed by Rotec an Italian company controlled by Dillinger and Scheidel Rosanirum GmbH and Co. KG. The parent company, leader in the German market, is specialized in the restoration and renewal of piping with no dig systems, meaning without excavation. There are now literally hundreds of thousands of meters of piping being replaced throughout the world. To face this new challenge, the engineers of the planning study were able to rely on Rotec's experience and expertise at an international level from the parent company. An executive project was born. The result of this joint work, which was named Renewal of the Hydroelectric DN 700 mm of the San Pietro facility of Funes. The pipes date back to the last century and the power company is going to renew the turbines that are powered by water. The staff of Rotec had verified the state of the piping, meter by meter, with a robotic video camera a year before. And after performing a series of spectrometric measurements, they ruled out the need to replace all the piping. However, this analysis revealed a worrying fact the internal side of the steel piping had begun to show signs of corrosion. Corrosion means loss of power. The fall of the water is held back. And this translates into a lack of efficiency for the new turbines. The roughness coefficient was lowered. But how? The decision was on the Sandflex system from Rotec a rehabilitation system for pipes containing fluid under pressure. A sleeve impregnated with epoxy resin is applied inside the pipe. The resin glues the sleeve that is coated with polyethylene perfectly to the pipe so that the fluid can flow without friction. But how did the staff of Rotec manage to restore over 1,600 meters without spoiling the landscape and with minimal impact on the lives in the valley? To start with, the area of the yard is bordered with care and most importantly, the welding points between the various sections are identified. It is a delicate operation which is always supported by the local council to minimize the disturbance to the land and the people who live there. In this case, 
Eight areas have been identified for as many excavations into which the sleeve will be inserted inside the piping. Every area has been carefully prepared. The projections were milled so as to facilitate the insertion. Each section has been cleaned by inserting and then recovering a probe capable of jetting water under very high pressure. More than 1,000 bar. After cleaning, the part that was just treated is then inspected with a robotic camera with the utmost care so as not to leave anything to chance. Any imperfection in the pipes is then removed by intervening step by step, meter by meter, from the inside. Each joint of the steel pipe is inspected and controlled individually. The spigot joints are sealed one by one with a special cement. Only after this delicate and meticulous preparatory work, the preparation and application of the sleeve are able to start. The inliner is impregnated and placed in the pipeline. It is a delicate operation which the staff from Rotec are more than capable of performing with the necessary automation. Any moment of delay, indecision or error would affect the entire insert. The sleeve must be inserted before the resin starts to set. There needs to be experience, training and a good cooperation within the team. Once it comes out from the opposite side, the inliner is cut and shaped. In each of the eight excavations, the sections are joined using steel trunks. Each element has been coated before installation with the same Sandflex system just to ensure that the fluid flows unhindered. But it's not that simple. At every welding point, a part of the band has to be removed. Anything in contact with the red-hot area will burn in an instant. To avoid risks, special sleeves are used, called Amex. These strips of rubber are pressed inside the pipe with stainless steel. The sleeve has been removed and the water can flow without hindrance. The delicate process is almost finished. A robotic camera is inserted for a remote visual inspection of the pipe just installed. And then, the long-awaited moment. The test under a pressure of 20 bar, as required by the standard UNI EN805. The water starts to flow, faster than before, and can power the new turbines more efficiently. Sandflex is suitable for restoring all pipelines under pressure, not only water, but also gas. The system makes restoration economically viable because it is done rapidly with small excavations. No impact on the environment because between one excavation and the next there can be a stretch of up to 300 meters, surpassing curves of up to 90 degrees, managing pipes up to 1200 millimeters in diameter. In the case of lateral connections there is still no need to excavate as it is done with a drill from the inside of the pipe. That's why Sandflex is also perfect for restoring water systems where distribution pipelines have lots of bends and connections. The low cost, along with being efficient and environmentally friendly, makes it the ideal choice for all those administrations that set the same objective of being efficient and economical at the same time in public affairs.